Hello, I'm Dr. Jesse L. Grice, uh, founder and pastor in, of Truban Baptist Church right here in San Antonio, Texas. Just want to share with you my salvation experience. Well, I didn't get saved until I was 27 years old. And so God uh, blessed me and I asked him to come into my life and save me and he blessed me. Not only there, but also called later into uh, to preach and to pastor. My call to ministry, the first call was to preach the gospel. I was uh, in college at, uh, uh, at um, my church, I'm sorry, at my school there in Nebraska. And um, he called me to preach and I was asking other pastors, uh, you know, about it and what should I do? And they all didn't have any mercy that he said, son, go ahead and do what God says to do. And so I accepted his call to preach and uh, then God blessed me to do other things. And so I'm excited about what he has done and what a blessing it has been uh, all this time. I suppose the greatest achievement in my ministry as a pastor, uh, when God blessed us to move from the shopping center to our first church. And to start it off, I didn't know how to build a church and didn't have many help with, helps with that. Uh, but uh, I was talking to a person who actually built churches and I drew the church out on a piece of napkin. And so the small church down the hill in our area is what we started at and it was off the napkin. But what's so wonderful about it is I moved into the church, uh, all about 64 people uh, that is. And within a year we had baptized more than 145 people. And after that, God really began to open the doors of grace and mercy. And within every year for three years, we actually grew to over 700 people. And I also had to do four services in the place, but we could only have 120 within the sanctuary. But God made a way for us to do it. And we had uh, four services every Sunday. The fourth service was a baptism service. So many people were coming for baptism, but they were bringing their friends and their loved ones and their families. So we had to have room. So it was uh, anticipated for them to be baptized. So therefore we had a full service. And so that was one of the greatest experiences that I've had in ministry. And I just give God all the praise and all the glory for it. For he certainly is a great and awesome God. The advice I would give to a younger minister is to, especially a younger pastor, uh, three things, to pray, uh, to pray, and to pray. But secondly, I would definitely tell them to wait on the Lord, talk to God, and do whatever the Lord says. Stay on the Word of God. Don't worry about what's happening around you in other pastorates. Just give God your whole mind, soul, body, and strength and allow God to work through you in whatever capacity that he may have you. And then God will open up great doors for you and bless you. I suppose the funniest baptism story was uh, baptism just recently. A couple young people, uh, they were really children. And one was about seven years old. And when he got into the water, all he could say was, "Woo! this water is cold. <laughs> and so we had a great laugh at that with his parents and God blessed him. And what a wonderful time we had in worship that day. Mm -hmm.